morning guys back up in the sand hills for the well i'm not gonna say it's the final sand hills hunt of the year but more than likely the final sand hills hunt of the year we've got a couple other zones opening up next week so we're gonna try hunting them and then we can go all across the state the whole state will be open next weekend and uh you know we're gonna get out and get some new territory get uh hunt a little closer to home but for now, we are up in a completely new lake in the sand hills. As I've said many times before, there are just so much water up here, so much different area, and there's just so many birds, which, you know, it, it can make it hard, but there's just so much water, not that much pressure, and so the birds will just find a little pond they like and stay there, and without any weather, you're not really gonna move them. So we're at a completely new spot, and uh, haven't hunted this this year yet. Hunted it last year. Had decent luck. Had a really good mixed bag. That's the hunt we got that pintail and canvas bag on last year. Yesterday's hunt of you know it was it's gonna be hard to top yesterday's hunt with all them canvas back. But uh, hopefully we can finally get some pintails. We haven't got a Drake pintail in yet, and I know Devin really wants one, but I would I would like one too. <laughs> <laughs> Heath wouldn't mind one, so we would all we would all like a Drake Pintel, I guess. <laughs> but we're gonna get at it and uh, see what happens. Got a little bit of competition out here. Looks like some guys on gonna have a boat blind on the other side of the lake we're hunting on, and some other guys just left to hunt another lake. So maybe we can keep some birds moving around between us. Might be a good thing. Not much wind predicted, and it's supposed to be about seventy-five degrees. So it's gonna be a warm one for the last day of the Sand Hills hunts. Sand hills finale, let's do it right. Just had three teal come in and land right before shooting, so hopefully they'll come back. Sound like blue wings. That's time, guys. Just been out here about 45 minutes and had a couple teal land in our decoys already. Since then, haven't seen anything flying. Got just a gentle breath of wind, a little more than yesterday, so that should be good, should help us. We don't have any clouds, so it's going to be another bright, sunny day, hence the face paint. There's another group on the other side of the lake, and then there's another group at another lake. So, should be able to bounce them around, hopefully. We'll see what happens. Gonna have to wait them out today. A little bit of shooting up north. Nothing here yet. This might be a tough one today, guys. Oh, we got four ducks, four ducks. Right over that seagull. Go. I got one. Had a flock of four come in. We caught them from all the way over here. And they came in, gave us a look. We were able to get one at least. So. Not a skunk, which is always a good thing. Ha ha, look at that. Another canvas back in the sand hills. The important thing is we didn't get skunked. Yes. Thank you, Heath. Where at? Kill that one, kill that one. Yep. Got four. Kill that one, kill that one. Yep. Good job, Timber. Well, that makes the day a little better. Yeah. They were <laughs> I didn't see, they were like they two just, foot over the water. Girl, bring it here. That was perfect though. They did it, oh, I think it's pulling them divers in really helped. That, that spinner, good girl. Guys, look at that. That was pretty good shooting. Oh, and it, uh, you know, not seeing too many ducks flying today or 
here you know we're hearing some shots in other areas but uh man gotta make the most of your opportunities today and i say we did that on that walk that's awesome a little bit of a diver shoot in the sand hills again guys yeah. high five <laughs> that was good that was good it's got a couple more balls of buffalo head in i'd be fine with that just a full 17 with <laughs> with a canvas pack <laughs> <laughs> that's why you gotta love the sand hills you just never know what kind of ducks you're gonna get or geese or whatever Mom, cans yesterday Mom, buffalo heads today still see it really low really low by the window. yep He's not gonna stop. Thank you. Oh yeah. Another buffalo head, guys. We're just scratching out buffalo head today, I guess. A few divers here and there. Well, we had a south wind this morning and it's shifted. Oh, geez. That was a big ball. Yeah, there's guys on the other side. They're tearing them up, sounds like. But uh, had a south wind and now it's shifted completely on us to the northeast which is what it's supposed to do this afternoon but it's a little ahead of schedule so we're going to just move move some around what are they i know but what what are they one more pass i think they're bent We can only shoot two of those guys. I got mine. I got one. Timber. That's the best decoy and pintail action I've ever seen. Only thing is there wasn't a lot of drakes in there. We got four. Devin got his two. Heath and I both got one. We should have both had, you know, we should have had six down. But, man, I was just in awe that they worked that good. That's awesome. Look at that. Guys, first pintail of the year for me. I think for all of us, actually. What did we say? It'd be really cool if we all got a pintail today. <laughs> Look at that though. Four pintails out of a group. We had a nice group. They And they were sky high when we first saw them. And wow, just worked beautifully. Just circled like four times. And we got them all cupped up. Oh, I can't beat that. That was the best pintail working I've ever seen. Did you see that when I just hit them with that little bit of comeback and they just went boom right around? Well, they made four, what was like four passes. They were pretty tall when we when we saw them first oh, and they we, just we came around. Saw them here and they cupped up, they dropped out of the sky. They just and then like circled a couple and times. Up and, they yeah. circled. and it was a perfect shot. They just came right in front. I think they would have been gone. Like I don't think they would have come back if I would have. No, I don't I think I don't think they would have. That's how you're supposed to work birds. And Except I thought you guys were gonna call it like two seconds earlier. I was like, no, let them work, let them in, let them in, let them in. No, we want them, we want them in tight. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't calling anything. If there was a nice drake and it was the first one up, I would have shot it. <laughs> I would have been jumped up five five seconds before all you guys. He said he would have shot and then you would have him. <laughs> Boom, guys, shoot. Got him. <laughs> I was just looking for bands, you know, they had, had their legs out, so. Yeah, legs, legs down. Got your pintail that you wanted. I did, you got two pintails. Yeah, canvasbacks yesterday, pintails today, mm -hmm. buffalo heads today. Buffalo heads both days. This is a crazy, just, it's a crazy limit we're gonna have today if we do, or just crazy bag. How does two groups just all of a sudden make our day? That's, that's literally all it's take, other than that one buffalo head and those canvas packs two groups are a majority of our ducks 
90 percent of our decks yeah yeah and they've made the day literally those two groups have made the day worthwhile yeah Devin, you take it or i'll take it oh crap <laughs> Devin's done. Heath, you got two more to go. Teal. Yep. Green wings. Had a pair of teal come in. Heath and Devin both got one. Devin is done for the day. He likes to shoot his limits early. You can't tell. Heath and I both have two more to go. So we're kind of just going to wait them out. It's not super fast action. We're not really seeing many. But the ones we do are coming in and they're, they're working. So... Not gonna complain about that by any means. What else do you want to shoot, Devin? <laughs> you. <laughs> yeah. What else is on your bucket list? Yeah. What's What's a duck that you haven't gotten yet that you would just love to shoot? A duck that I haven't got yet, Drake Woody. Let's get four Drake Wood ducks in here, oh, Heath. That would be nice. Four banded money band Drake Wood ducks, hundred dollars each with one hybrid mallard pintail. What would that be called? A, a little feather power. A mintail. A mintail. A mintail. Did you shoot? Yeah. Good Never. job. I thought I dropped that him, but I'm like, I didn't have my gun up, Never. so no, there's probably no way. Did you shoot? I shot once. Your spread was Timber split. here. Yeah, I don't. I didn't get up on it in time. Yeah. I thought you were just gonna shoot both of yeah. them, and you did. <laughs> I shouldn't have even shot. I should just let you. I was like, is somebody gonna shoot that second one? Or, uh, well, she was gonna land. She was gonna land. <laughs> I didn't have my gun up. I thought Heath was gonna just drop both of them, and then I, I thought I was gonna drop both of them on my first shot. And then, yeah, and I saw when I saw her kept going, so I'm like, I better hurry and try to. Try to get her. Nice. Yep. Another on limit. More. Waiting on two more. It's about 10.30 now, guys. Most of the ducks have shut off. Gonna give her till 11, and then we're just gonna call her. Just waiting on two ducks. That's all I need. These boys already limited out a long time ago. Watch her. Kill him again. Kill him again. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Got one. One more to go. Not the best shooting. Ringer. Where'd he go? There he is. There. Nice ring neck. Look how beautiful. That's a beautiful one. I have one more duck to go. We're starting up the duck counter. Got it at 1050. 1120. We have to at least see a duck come in. We're just going to call her. One shy of a limit for me. Heath got a limit, and Devin got a limit. I got five. Oh yeah, look at all them birds. Ugh. That's a heck of a way to end the sand hills season. Yeah. We might be back up here once or twice later, later in the year, but we've got the whole state of Nebraska finally opens up for waterfowl. So we have the whole state to hunt um, for waterfowl. So we're gonna explore some new terrain, explore some new areas and uh, hopefully shoot some more ducks. It was a great day though, guys. We had to make our shots count. Didn't see that many birds, but uh, these two guys, they did. I Not so much me, you know, that ring neck uh, <laughs> should have been dead in one shot, but still got him. They, they got their limits. They're letting me have it, you know, typical, typical ribbing if you don't get your bird limit. But uh, hopefully, hopefully next weekend will be first limit while i've been with devin he's gotten his limit how many times since you've been hunting with me this year three three i have gotten my limit when i've been hunting with devin zero <laughs> so hopefully next weekend we'll bring new luck heath what do you think of today oh, you get some I more first was, yeah i thought got 
What else did I? Oh yeah, I got a first pintail. Um, first time I've ever seen a ring neck. Um, it was a really good hunt. Yeah, the way those buffalo head did it that one time, we knocked the whole oh. flock. That was. Those that was buffalo well head. Worth it, yeah. Those buffalo head did it awesome. I've never seen buffalo head work like that, like in a flock. Oh yeah. no. Like a single one, yeah, but I've never seen buffalo head work like that. I don't it was think they. I don't think crazy. they got above like three feet above the water all the way across the lake. lake or those pintails those pintails that was, those pintails really were crazy. crazy yes what three four spins around maybe three yeah. spins sky around. high circled three or four times and <laughs> gave us all good shots yeah that was that was awesome just a fun day great way to close it out up here uh the only bad thing that happened i guess is me losing my new call that i literally just bought four days ago but other than that great day great day hopefully another you know hopefully the new zones that open up will be will be just as good yeah but that's all i have for you guys today thank you so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed this video hopefully you enjoy all of our videos if you did be sure to give us a thumbs up down below really helps us out drop a comment let me know what your thoughts were are you guys you have some new zones opening up are you getting the birds where you're at let me know down below i'm always Always want to hear from you guys. Subscribe if you haven't already so you can stay up to date with our latest hunting and fishing exploits as well as outdoor recipes and how-to tips and tricks. And we'll catch you out there, guys. See ya.